Five minutes. <laughs> Five minutes to walk to the beach. I'm used to drive next to the beach and just walk out straight in the water. The intro parking challenges. <laughs> For me, it's you know me, it's a bit uh, crowded. It's not crowded. Before we start with the video, I want to say there are two types of folk one like uh, crowds, one don't like crowds. That's it. That's uh, all I wanted to say. Except for those who don't know what Kolaris is, it's parish of Sintra, southwest of Sintra. And the road there is beautiful, so we are not skipping that part. Back to the video. Hello guys and this beautiful day. Hola todos. Hi everyone. Today we are going to Kolaris, which in translation means necklaces. <laughs> Why? I don't know. It will take about uh, 30 minutes. We are departing from Kashkaish. Vamos. Today is nice, chilly, 31 degrees outside. But in Kolaris it will be 3 or 4 degrees colder. This is gonna be Malveira da Serra. This is where uh, my channel first video was filmed. And while we are going to Kolarish, I can say that area is 33 square kilometers with around 7,000 inhabitants. So that was turned to Cabo de Roca or Cabo de Roca. But we are not going today there. We are going uh, six kilometers further. Oh, whoa, oh, oh, whoa, oh, oh, whoa, amigos, amigos. Narrow Portuguese roads. Fogo. My back is a bit sweaty from these roads. Botar, you already exhausted? <laughs> it's been 23 minutes on the road. And by the way, we came from Latvia with our little Ford Fiesta. And it took us five days, yeah? Yeah. 4,400 kilometers. Five days? Five days, yeah, yes, something, something like, like that. that. Yeah, not in a rush, like. Not in a rush, 150, 170 with Fiesta on <laughs> a bicycle on the roof. <laughs> there is also some river I see on a map. Sintra, where we need to turn, 100 meters to the left. I think this is already Collage. It is, there was a sign. Yeah? Yeah. Azenas do mar, praias. And no, no people. At oh, least. you see? Yeah, mud hole. Now we are on a mission to find the parking. Oh, there is train, tram tracks also. Here. 
Jā, tikai ar kājām te iet arī ir kā ir, ne? We will be in highest point, I think, only... Ah, I see Pena from here. Oh. Nice. We are stuck in some terrible, terrible... Ah, oh, maybe we can find parking there. Whew! <laughs> from driver's perspective, this is uh, a hassle a bit. <laughs> Maybe I need to leave here. What do you think? We stop here? Can we just yeah. stay here on yeah. the road? Yeah. We started uh, not on a coastal part of Kolarš, but more inland. And what can I tell that already in 20th century, rich families from Lisbon discovered this area for holidays and chilling out. Just like we are doing today. Sintra parking challenges. <laughs> oh. Let's go. Birds, quiet and peacefulness. Only downside, narrow roads, both for cars and for walking. I'm not complaining. Something like that. What's yeah. there? Fishes? Yeah. Oh, see. Quite big ones. Mm -hmm. I hope not predatory. <laughs> see? Look. Yeah. That's crazy. <laughs> so it's fish soup. <laughs> <laughs> wow, but I like this place. It's super quiet. It's like Sintra, but uh, your own private Sintra. Yeah. Lady told this is old Kolarš, yes? Yes. Old part of Kolarš. Yes, the center of Kolarš, old part. But Why this is you? definitely like fairy tale village. <laughs> not uh, pedestrian friendly, <laughs> but not the first time. This is the church, second church, I think. Church the Misericordia. Yeah, 
yeah, the old part is beautiful, but not much going on here. So we are going to more active place. Let's go to Azenius Domar. I think uh, she will enjoy more there. Okay. And the center? Uh, Kolarish? Yes. I've seen it's just the main street and uh, that's it. Okay. Wait, I will go first. I will go first. You don't want to try it in the front? That's what she said. <laughs> All good. That was fast, we already arrived, so it's seven minutes from Kolaris. Coastal part of Kolarish, some uh, great beaches, Praia das Masas, Praia Adraga, Adraga or Adragas, Praia Grande, and typical coastal village of the area, Azenius do Mar. Water mills of the sea. Am I right? We just arrived here. Let's see what this place can offer. It's recording. <laughs> yes, I'm getting out of the car. So we arrived in uh, one of the most Instagrammable places. Not in Portugal, but in the region. In Sintra. Let's see expectations in real life. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Nice party place, enjoying sandwiches. This is non-alcoholic sagras. Chin in Kolarish. <laughs> but uh, if upstairs it was around 30 degrees, then downstairs I think it's 20, 21, no? 31 was in Kashkais. Here it was 22. So ah. here, near the ocean, it feels like 19 actually.
So Kalara is the old part. It's uh, with a beautiful view everywhere. Every house has a beautiful view, but it's so uh, claustrophobic. Yeah, say yeah. things like they are. <laughs> yeah, it's claustrophobic. And here, the view is amazing. Probably the pool. It's like you know, like natural pool. Nothing special. But they made all this part, so it's cool place. Very cool place. For my wife. <laughs> In my opinion. <laughs> For me, it's you know me. It's a bit uh, crowded. It's not crowded. It's almost empty. I was shocked that there are not so so much people. Like not many, not many. Like come on, it's but crowded for you. I will uh, like it from upstairs with my drone. <laughs> <laughs> Seriously. go swimming? Sure we can do. We are going to Praia Grande? Yes, probably. Yeah. Uh, from the name it sounds like big beach. Yeah, it's a long coastline with, uh, with the great waves. <laughs> okay, let's check it out then. My wife just told me I'm very spoiled because I'm not impressed with Azenias do Mar. <laughs> Very beautiful place, and he's saying, "Yeah, nothing special." Like, seriously, seriously, you need to travel less to enjoy. I need to travel less. Yeah, to enjoy the beauty of Portugal. Ah, uh, okay, noted. Noted. Travel less. Travel less. No videos, guys. <laughs> See you after half year. <laughs> yeah. Before we depart, I can say that during my three years living in Portugal. I became a I really became a because uh, three years ago I could swim in the winter in the ocean. This year I cannot swim anywhere. Even this place where we just been. It's crazy how fast you adapt. Now I'm a new Ecomedo. I say it right? Or I said something different? <laughs> Damn. Oh. It's good 40 degrees Celsius in the car. But just in the car. Okay, vamos. So from Azenas to Praia Grande, it is nine minutes, four kilometers. A lot of luxury housing, it looks like that, and uh, average price for Kolarish for buying is 4,700 euros per square meter, so it's almost double the price of uh, Silver Coast. It's not almost, it's even more than two times the price. Huh? Almost crashed. And uh, long-term rent is 19 euros per square meter per month. But there was only uh, 25 properties. So expensive place, expensive place. You know what I mean. Praia Grande is there. Where oh, we can park. Damn. What the crap? I wanted to say that last time when I was here it was empty. And then you said the comment about the S. Like seriously, can we use this? <laughs> and this is a Praia Grande. It's not so grande. <gasps> I was in uh, where it was in Figueira do Foz. It was much bigger beach. That's the Praia Grande. This is three out of dash, trash the dash. I will give you a free tip. If you're going to this beach, please leave the car at the beginning of the parking. Because if you want to go closer to the beach, you will fail. Like we did. 
we lost 15 minutes. 15 minutes of our precious life. Finally, we found the parking, uh, but uh, to be honest, guys, I'm used to when I go to the beach, I just park my car and go to the beach. Now we went again, spoiled. The beach is there. Yeah, but we still need to walk like, like five, five minutes. minutes. <laughs> five minutes to walk to the beach. I'm used to drive next to the beach and just walk out straight in the water. What can I say? Nothing extraordinary. No. <laughs> about 17 degrees there's no way I'm swimming in this don't be such a baby no. give me the mic there's no point in swimming because uh, I have cramps in my legs. <laughs> I don't want to think other parts, what will happen with them? Finally, the beach day. Now we can chill out and relax for a couple of hours. Well, amigos and amigos, that's it for today. What can we tell about Kolarish? You know me. I like more remote uh, parts of Portugal, but every now and then you can see me also in these kind of busier places. My wife, she loved the old part. Okay, it's a bit narrow, but uh, views were beautiful and uh, nature, peacefulness. She loved it. I loved that part also. What comes to coastal part? I'm a Silver Coast boy. I'm a Silver Coast boy. Uh, but my wife, she said, Desh de Desh. She loved it there. She likes the vibe. She likes the atmosphere of Azenas do Mar, Praia Grande. We were passing also Praia das Massas. She loved it. For me, I would say it's 6 out of 10. Now come closer. Don't forget to like and subscribe and become a member if you want to see exclusive videos from my day-to-day -day journey in Portugal. See you next time. Peace. No, that was the wrong. Ciao.